And folks, it's now time for Carmella. And might I add, Carmella is looking quite fabulous tonight. Byron, how big is this match for these two teams here tonight? Well, Michael, the tag team division is white hot right now. So while a win will obviously be huge, I can tell you that a loss would be absolutely devastating. Given the competition right now, a loss tonight would be a huge setback. Stephanie McMahon brought Charlotte, Becky Lynch, and Sasha Banks to WWE. And those three women changed the course of history as we know it today. Yeah, Sasha Banks has been a trailblazer. She has been at the forefront of that change. In fact, Sasha's career-long motto, be so good, they can't ignore you. You should get one of those uh, rings that say graves on it like Sasha has. I'll pass. Oh, you're looking at the future right here. WWE Universe, you are looking at a superstar who is simply blessed to be the best, just naturally better than everybody else, even when only doing the bare minimum. Well, you talk about some of that natural athletic talent, Corey. Bianca's been exceptional her entire life. She earned all SEC and all American honors in track and field at the University of Tennessee. And if you just ask her, she'll tell you why she's better than everybody else. You got eyes, Byron, you understand. A freak in the weight room, a beast in the ring. Bianca Belair can do it all. And she's got a lethal hair whip. Here we go, guys. Tag team action is underway. A lot of times you see champs dial it back a bit when the title's not on the line, but I don't expect to see that from her here. Applied. Oh, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh! oh. Ah, it's gonna break their arm. Oh, what an 
impact. Oh, what impact! In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. What a stomp! Good grief! Neckbreaker! In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch and the referee must see the tag be made. When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. Nailed it! Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is their ability to endure punishment and make their way to their partner when they need to tag out. One way to do that is to create that separation you spoke of so they have some space to gather themselves and time to make their way back to the corner. You're absolutely right, Michael. What's the use of having a tag team partner if you're not able to get to them when you got to tag out of the match? Getting that separation is key in breaking any momentum your opponents could have may be the difference between a win and a loss. Maybe even more. Harsh impact. Oof. What a strike. Oh, and she gets floored by that one. Yeah, there's no staying on your feet. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. Snapmare. Incredible agility. She's on the attack and on the move. Oh. And there's the reversal from Sasha Banks. Gets the tag. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar. Code of silence. Incredible. Has Carmella produced an end result? Looking at it here. She's starting to sweat a bit. Her and her partner make it a great tag team. Wow. We'll see what they're made of. No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston. This could end it in a shooting oh. kick! <laughs> She's back in full control now. Oh man, Sasha Banks is in trouble now. Got the shoulders down. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam.
I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage, and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots, but I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever, and what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record-setting 483 days. When looking at the WWE roster, I would underline Sasha Banks as one of our risk-takers in the ring. Bailey hooks her up. And there's that corner exploder suplex. Game, set, match. This one is over. Sasha Banks dodged out of the way there. A quick reversal by Bailey. She is on fire. We bring up Sasha's tendency to be unpredictable and risky. This really this could be all she wrote. She better do something fast. Ah, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Hey, Byron, just like you. Interrupt. She's got it now, but here's a cover. Could be it. And she kicks out with relative ease. Too yeah. soon. Ah, the backstabber. It's Sasha with a bank statement. The bank statement. She can pick up the win here, guys. Two. And she kicks out at two. She's still in this one. Well, Nelson applied. She might have it. Oh, impactful slam. Bad news for the boss. That is a huge. That should do it right there. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. She's looking at it. Looking to flip the tongue. <laughs> Bad news for the boss. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed. And, and now Bailey is putting on a clinic. She's flipped the switch, and the light is on. Absolutely planted. Oh, nasty impact. What a hurricanrana. But I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as a Bailey's looking to end it. Dive. Bad news for the boss. Sasha Banks is in a bad. Look at this. One, two. You've got to believe this one's over. Bailey has her inner sights. Going for broke. WWE superstar. Beautiful technique. And she looked like she had no chance just a few moments. And the cover for the win. Two. She's not done yet. Wow, and Sasha has seen better days, but she's still alive. And that's all that matters right now. Hurricane Rana! I don't think we can understate what you brought up, Michael. Abu Dhabi really cemented Sasha as a trailblazer, not just for women in the WWE. Uh-oh, Sasha Banks is looking at it. Oh, my. Ooh. Nailed it. Bailey is showing she can top trash and taunt with the best of them. Ooh, what impact. She's on the attack and on the move. Locked in. It's locked in. Bad news for the boss. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch up. Carmella just barely got out of the way. On oh, some good technique right there. Leg drop. She's 
she's beginning to take some heat here. At this point, it's fair to wonder how much more she has to give here tonight. She's taking on quite a bit of damage here, guys. And if she doesn't find a way to make the tag soon, this one might be over. I don't know. I expect her to get back on track here very shortly. I mean, she's been in control for much of the match. I look for that to continue here. Oh, man, she is rolling now. Look at her go. Just a step quicker, it looks like. to do it. At some point, the referee may want to think about stopping this one before somebody gets... What a tag team display. A lot of good action in that one. Here's another look. Who could forget this? I remember this part very well. That's a woman on a mission. Ain't nothing better than action like this. Talk about having to dig down deep to pick up the win. Well, when you put women like these together, what do you expect to happen?